Good morning everyone and welcome back to my channel. It's a weekly vlog 26 this week and yesterday was the halfway point of the year so it's the 2nd of July now. Yesterday the 1st of July that was halfway through the year and I just cannot believe that like weekly vlog 26 is halfway through the year. How crazy is that? I just can't get over it. Anyway it's Monday morning now. It's like really early which is why I'm talking quiet. I don't know it just feels weird to be like hey guys when it's like seven in the morning and I just woke up but I'm leaving the house now to go to Neve's house so I'm going to hang out at Neve's house for a little bit and then Neve's mum is going to take me Neve and Bronte op shopping in the city which is really exciting because I've never been op shopping don't think Bronte has but Neve definitely has so she's going to show us all the cool places and I'm really excited so this is what I'm wearing nothing too really exciting just my usual outfit the pink filler like oversized jumper with these mum jeans from City Beach. Wow, I saw my old boots on. I'm gonna wear my Lacoste sneakers, I think. But yeah, that's all. And I still sound a bit wheezy because like I'm, I'm not sick anymore. I just have a bit of like a cough, as you know from last week. It's quite sick. But yeah, I've got a bit of like asthma and a cough and that kind of thing. So that's not fun. But yeah, hopefully I'll get to vlog a bit today when we go up shopping. now. <laughs> Not impressed. Okay, this is La Trobe Terrace. Neve knows all about where we are and what the best finds are. Mm. So, if you wanted to go to where we went, this is La Trobe Terrace. And it's like, like, and, ah! right. <laughs> and we're also, we went to Petrol, which was in the um, oh God, montage. And, oh, okay. oh, oh it is. Oh, anyway, people. I said that. <laughs> I did not mean to say that Petrol was a bit like a op shop because it's just not it's but we just went there on the way and it's just included in the montage just a little disclaimer because I do not think Petrol is an op shop Absolutely it was not. so it's nice like in there <laughs> anyway oh my god this is so cute oh, that to sell it to you though too because I feel like she was kind of oh, quite damn. like a pushy sales so. not pushy but like she was just yeah I was like kept kind of oh the like, sun is so oh, bright like, I'm, I'm gonna go to be like grey one yeah Imagine if I found a corduroy jacket I don't know I just don't like people that are really pushy like I understand that like it's for a good cause but we're gonna make our own decision either way so yeah. I don't know I just don't like it no I'm happy with like my decision but yeah you didn't make 
make your own decision. And you yeah. got a cute little bag. And I'm glad Bronte got that. So then I can <laughs> yes. And I love that um pink one. Yeah. Pink and I like the black one too, just because yeah. it's like country music and it's, it's like very rough. It speaks to me on a like spiritual level. Oh, I love it. <laughs> so full. I was going to get anything up shopping though. I know, I've never been up shopping. I didn't buy anything, but I <laughs> enjoyed like, the experience. Oh my god. Like, how much so did you spend? Like 130 altogether. Like 73. 73. Oh, you got like two, okay. you got four okay. items. Behold my magic squid. Oh my god, Mabel got a prize. Where are you? There we go. <laughs> Do you want to be in the vlog, Tanya? What is it? Okay, <laughs> so it's my like YouTube show. Yeah. Yeah. I think we bought it at Formal, at Pre. Really? I had this at Pre, yeah. It's okay, you look okay. pretty. Right. This is, Neve was the host of Pre for everyone in the vlog that remembers. And this is, <laughs> <laughs> this is Tanya News mum. Hi. Who's been taking a shopping. <laughs> is there a toilet around? Oh, a toilet? Yeah. Oh, it's not there. <laughs> Hello, everyone. Hello. 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 So we're just making a quick stop in at DFO. Oh my gosh. <gasps> These are $15? No, they're for, they're for, Oh my god, are you kidding? Oh, I like it. Oh my god. This is insane. Let's get shopping. <gasps> Doesn't buy anything up shopping, comes to Cotton On, spends, I don't know, how much? Are you zooming? Yes. <laughs> No, I can't zoom back, back out. What the hexagon ones? No, Ollie needs to get these. <laughs> Leave in the comments. I can really buy these. Pink fluffy jandals. Yeah, they are. Show us. <laughs> They're the same as. <laughs> yeah. Well, the khaki, Ollie would be. Also, I'm getting this bag because it's and so, so lights. cute. No, thank you. Imagine me driving my car around like this. I don't have a car, so I'm driving my car. As a bit of getting in here so I can get these. <laughs> my op shopping experience. <laughs> Drifting fine. <laughs> it's got like cotton on. So much cotton on. Wait, the girls are going to haul what they got and then we'll do it in order of like what shops we've been to. Okay. It's just a green t shirt. <laughs> it's cute though. Um, where was it from? This one was from the Salvo store. And how much? $4. Oh my god, I forgot. We even went there. That feels like so long ago. Oh. Mm. With that weird lady that was like... <laughs> <laughs> was that a man or a lady? I don't know. I bought this shirt. It's so cute on though. I don't know what it says on it, but it's got like... You yeah, have to close up to the camera. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Wait, but... do I need to like put my hand behind it? <laughs> <laughs> a black shirt that has country music muster on it because I love country music and it's like that. And then I got... um. A corduroy jacket. That's my favourite. All together, yeah. how much was it? Like 120 for like yeah. these three. Yeah. Yellow. Okay. Well, I got this shirt. It's just like a Brisbane one. What and then I got think? like this, like, I like that jumper. So mm. It's like cute though. Yeah. And then we went to another op shop. And then I got this. It was like an actual like op shop. It was like, yeah, three dollars. Mm. Oh yeah, I bought a clutch for um. Well, can I say the school? Probably not. No. Not for a formal. <laughs> oh. <laughs> um, yeah, it was a dollar. <laughs> That's honestly, it's so useful. It's so cute. So yeah. Like, as if you got a clutch and it's for a like, dollar. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> so I got this. Um, we went to Cotton on Body at DFO and I got this pajama shirt, which is a long sleeve. You can't mm. see the straps. And it's got these straps on the shoulders. It's really cute. It was on sale. Thank you. Because I'm not in the middle, because someone has to always be in the middle. <laughs> <laughs> and I got these matching shorts, which are also Can't very cute. Mic. Okay, that was um, <laughs> that plus these cute socks and you the bought mid the socks. The, yeah, no, did you buy socks? <laughs> did you buy the matching socks? <laughs> They're too long. 
Hey. That, 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 and plus the mints that the children wanted at the checkout. Yeah. Uh, Speaking of watermelon, mints, the, um, lady the, we, oh, yeah. the lady at the checkout was like, I recommend the watermelon. I want those watermelon mints that so go towards the charity. They were all $30 altogether. And then I also bought this really cute bag from the actual cotton on store, which was $10, and it's a big nude tote bag. Do you want one? Yes. Anyway. <laughs> Wait, ready? Thanks for watching. Like, subscribe. Oh. Like and subscribe. See you tomorrow because it's a weekly vlog. Oh, true. It's all done. Pretty. Oh, shit. That's okay. Wait, no, transition. <laughs> <laughs> so it's Tuesday morning now, guys, and I'm just at home today. It's actually like 11 o'clock. Like, it's quite late in the morning. But I've decided today's just going to be a chill day at home, and I'm actually going to get some filming done. So I've tidied my room already, and I'm ready to go in that area but i need to set up my lighting because i don't think i told you guys but last week i like impulse bought some lighting and it wasn't really an impulse buy like i've been thinking about it for a while and the opportunity came up and you will see it in a video that i'm gonna film today with the lights if that makes sense so you'll see it actually you'll see it before this vlog goes up so today i'm gonna film a winter collective winter clothing haul and it's in collaboration with shop back which is like an online thing which you would already know all about if you watch the like clothing haul which i will link below um this is true for me out that you're gonna see a video i haven't even filmed before this one but anyway um and yeah basically i could order my lights using shop back to like show you guys how it works and i was like that's perfect because then i can use the lights in the video show you how it works blah 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 so i'm gonna set those up first so i can start filming than 20 minutes and I now have two fully set up shadow light boxes how cool is that I will show you what they look like so it's kind of hard to see those look like white boxes but if I come around here there's two of them and sorry my tripod's like in the way but you got a little base stand the like tall part and then like the little cords that are just plugged in like to a power board over there and yeah that's them how cool is that and they all just came in a box that big like a little box like that and it literally oh how good is that i'm just gonna try and get all the angles of all the different like lighting oh my god wow oh my camera's about to die anyway as i was saying those were 50 dollars from ebay and i'm literally so impressed with that purchase oh my goodness the only thing i was worried about because they were 50 dollars i just like read all the reviews on ebay before i bought them and they all said they were a really great like starter kit for lighting for like photography filming anything like that because i actually can go can go quite high like they'd be higher than my room ceiling so i think they are designed for like big photography like shoots and that kind of thing as well but um sorry i'm really out of breath again because i just set those up with standing up sitting down and everything but yeah, the only thing I was worried about after reading the reviews was knowing how to set it up because everyone was like, oh, there was absolutely no instructions in the box. Like, it was kind of complicated to set up. And I was like, oh, all right, we'll see how we go. There was no instructions in the box, but it's really common sense. Like, it's not that hard. There was, like, four different bits, like the stand, the light bulb, the, like, box, and then, like, the white sheet that goes in front. And it was so easy. It literally took me less than 20 minutes. I was so proud. So, yeah, and they also seemed really good quality. Like, not as shitty quality is what I was expecting so I'm really happy now I'm gonna go do my makeup because this is a real issue and then start filming good morning everyone it is Wednesday now it's like 10 30 I think and I've just gotten ready for the day because I'm doing something rather exciting this morning so you guys probably wouldn't know because I don't think I've ever mentioned it in the vlogs or anything on my channel but Gareth um, hasn't had his formal yet. It's in August and obviously I'm invited. So I need to start looking for like everything that I need to wear and book for that because it's August the 14th, I think. And today it is like the formal's August 
14th and today's the 4th of July so I need to get cracking but I think I, well, I've, I've been looking online and I think I know the, the exact dress I want so what I'm doing today is going into One Night Stand Boutique which is like a hiring boutique in the city and it's the same place I actually hired my dress from for my own semi-formal last year and they've got like heaps of designer brands that you can just hire for like one night hence the name and yeah I'm pretty sure what they stock well the dress that I want I saw on their like Instagram but the only thing I'm worried about is because their Instagram is like nationwide like for all of their stores it may not necessarily be in the Brisbane one so there's one in Brisbane which is in Tenerife like in the city um, and then they have like I think one in almost every major city like Adelaide, Sydney, Melbourne, all that kind of thing. So hopefully the Brisbane one has a dress I'm after but if not I could have just called ahead to check but I'm happy to still go even if they don't have my dress so I can try on others if to see if I like any of them. But yeah that's what I'm doing this morning and I will definitely show you guys if they have the one I want and if even if not I'll just show you the ones that I do try on. Because yeah, I'm really excited. So I'll do a little OOTD for today. Super, super cash. I'm wearing these blue A-brand jeans, my grey like sports girl tee, and then my Bellini slides, which are like the rose gold ones. Excuse the tan, oh my goodness. As you can tell, it's Wednesday and I tan on Thursdays, which is why it's looking so, so bad. So it's like 1.30 now and I just got changed for work because I have a 2 to 7 shift tonight. But I wanted to quickly kind of talk about my formal dress and ask for your guys' opinions because it'll be a bit confusing what I showed you in the little like try on clips. But basically I went in there to look for this dress which I will insert a photo of right here right now because they didn't have it so I obviously couldn't show you to try it on. But... I went in looking for that dress because I absolutely love the fit and the colour and the fabric and everything of it. But they didn't have that one. My second option that I'd seen photos of online that I really, really liked was that orange rust one that I tried on first. And I did quite like that, but it was a little baggy, so I could definitely go down a size. And I know I can, like, find somewhere else that has a smaller size to higher, so that's no problem. It is just obviously very like revealing as in the slits really high so you'd have to be like really careful like wearing it to a formal and like making sure you're not like showing anything while you're dancing and that kind of stuff which that it just which is the only downside to that dress otherwise I love the colour so 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 much and it's such a nice material it's like a really silky material. So there's that one and then the black one I quickly showed you is the exact same brand and fabric as that khaki one that I wanted but they obviously didn't have that khaki on but they have the black one that I tried on. I do not like black, black so I'm not going to wear it in black but I just tried on to see the fit and the material because that's the same as the one I like. So I can actually get that one in a light khaki which was the one that was in my hand. I can get the black one in that khaki colour that was in my hand. Or I can just get the one in the photo, which is a darker khaki, similar body fit, but a different neckline. So the one I like has the cow neck, and then the one I tried on has like the V with the underwire kind of thing. So they're my three options. I have no idea what to do. But yeah, option one is the rust one in a small size. Two is that like V neck with the underwire, the black one, but not in black. I'm not wearing black in the light khaki or the cow neck in the photo. 
which is in the dark khaki. So please let me know your thoughts down below because I have absolutely no idea. Gareth, Bronte, Neve, Mum, The Lady of the Shop, Lizzie, Grace, everyone is telling me different things and I don't know what to do. So please help me. But yeah, now I have to go to work. So I won't vlog for the rest of the day because I finish at 7 and then we have a meeting from... 7.15 to 8.15 pretty much so I'll chat to you guys another day. Hello everyone so it is Friday now and I did not vlog at all yesterday because I've already edited like up the vlog up until this point and I'm well aware that it's already 20 minutes long and way way too long so yesterday I had a boring day didn't vlog anything but today is Grace's birthday and I'm so excited because she's having a lunch first and then a party tonight and it is Friday. Did I say that? I did. So I'm going to lunch because it's like 12.30 and it's at 1. So I want to show you my outfit for that. And you guys have already seen this outfit before. I wore it to dinner a couple of weeks ago. But it's these overalls from, from Sunny and Sabor Boutique which is like an Instagram boutique. And then this white long sleeve is just from Factory. I'm going to wear my little Bellini slides because I was going to wear boots, but I'm already kind of regretting this outfit because it's actually a really nice hot day today, but anyway, I'll be okay. And then I'm so happy about my bag purchase. Do you remember my um, big tote bag that I got from DFO at the start of the vlog? This is absolutely perfect for this occasion because I'm going out for lunch so it's got to look nice with my outfit and it does, it does not clash at all but then it's got to be big enough to fit all my stuff because straight from lunch which is at Cafe 63 I'm going to go to Bronte's house just because it's closer and like what's the point in coming home because then I'll get ready for the party with Bronte and Neve because they're not invited to the lunch but we're all going to the party and possibly Lizzie, I don't know if she's coming to the party but if she is she'll be at Bronte's too but yeah. And then I'm going to go to Brunchies and get changed into a different outfit. I'm not wearing this, but everything's in my bag ready to go. And I'm going to drive there actually to get my hours up for my L's. So I will catch you guys probably when we're at lunch with Grace. Hi! Happy birthday, Gracie! I love that colour on you. He's impressive. Thank you. Do you, it it? you don't have to open it right now. We're not even sitting down. Do you want to vlog me? Oh, okay. Go on. Go on. <laughs> oh, my God. Hey, Amy. Welcome back. <laughs> I like your name. Oh Thank you. Oh my god, you're going to be lost out here. That one smells really good. I you're hope you like the smell walking. of it. I'm not going to open it. I'm trying to smell it. Yeah, yeah. Just, yeah you hold the it. base of it for it. Oh, your nails are so pretty too. It's not working. Oh, yes. me. I mean, I mean, sorry. Beep, beep, beep. Ellie. Ellie's like, I'm cutting all this stuff off. <laughs> How do you call the party so it's like, you know, not like, no, I'm not putting any of that in. So cute, I love that dress. Thank you. <laughs> it's not even mine. Damn. That looks amazing. Oh, I'm going to go to the bar. Yes, please. Thank you. Get chips. At the Thank you so much. We're going to run now. Thank you. Oh, my God. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Absolutely. Oh, hey everyone. <laughs> I'll do a little OOTD for us. So my whole outfit is Princess Polly. Thanks to Neve's wardrobe, my wardrobe. And then Neve's outfit. This is Bronte's. Where yes. Princess Polly. Princess Polly. <laughs> These jeans I got from a vintage shop and then my vans. Amazing. Bronte squeezed in. Give us an OOTD for us. Um, these are my shoes. This is Ellie's top and this is Neve's. Amazing. Don't know what shops, but anyway. That's our OTD. Now we're going to Grace's birthday party. Woo! <laughs>
thank you for watching Ellie's vlog. Like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next week on Sunday. As always, catch ya. <laughs>